What is going on everyone? Nick here and welcome back to some Hogwarts Legacy where last time we did some exploring we learned Confringo. I love the conviction he has when he says that. But we learned this. We got some we got some some cool spells. We just found the Undercroft. We learned a little bit about our boy Sebastian, told him some secrets about us. And uh and now we're going on. Going on to see what the next chapter of this game's looking like. Because we, I, this is, yeah, this is us completing all of our tasks for this phase. Mmm, that's not good. Hello, Sebastian. Wait. Oh, oh, oh. Through there. I can hear you. Oh, uh. hello. Ominous, isn't it? I believe we have potions together. Uh. And herbology? I recognize that voice. Heard you talking to Gareth Weasley in potions class. You're the new fifth year. Yep. Did you just come from the Undercroft? How did you get in there? Um, I stumbled upon it. We're not, we're not selling out our boy. That room's called the Undercroft. Ah, well, I was exploring and then suddenly found myself in a strange passageway. Don't lie to me. No one stumbles upon that room. Ugh. Sebastian told you, didn't he? Ugh. You breathe a word about this place to anyone. And not even your precious Professor Fig will be able to help you. My father is friends with the headmaster. Okay. I am not afraid to exploit that connection. Ugh, you're gross. Um, I'm gonna say, cause I, I, uh, he's a dick, but I get it. I'm gonna say I promise not to say anything. Trust me, ominous. I won't say a word. And Sebastian is a good friend. You shouldn't immediately assume the worst of him. I don't need you to tell me about my oldest friend. Thank you very much. Ominous, I just meant- I know what you meant. Sebastian gets himself in enough trouble. He doesn't need your help. All right, dog. Sebastian Whatever. is going to get an earful about this. <laughs> nice. All right. Still cool, like still. Oh, we got another towel point. Um. I, I'm, I'm excited to eventually do a Slytherin full unkillable curse run. <laughs> or not un unkillable. Un, um, what is it? Un... Un what? Unforgivable. That's the goddamn word I'm looking for. We got mail. Come and see me as soon as you can. Oh yeah, fig time. Return from a rather unproductive trip to the ministry. Hoping your time has been more fruitful than mine. Hell yeah. All right. Let's go. We gotta go talk to our boy. So I think that should be the only quest we have other than... Yeah. Alright, so we'll go to Fig. We did level up, so we do have another talent point to spend. We get these at 22. Let's see. Oh, we could get another spell knowledge. That's actually probably worth it. Alright. Let me set up my spells. <laughs> Let me absolutely do that. Because now we can have the rumor requirements be the uh, the bottom down here. I think I like that one being where it is. But we absolutely want that there. Yeah. This is fine as is. We probably eventually move this one down. And maybe even to Pulso. But okay. Yeah, we can't set those up early. All right. That works. Cool. How far away are we? Oh, he's literally, literally right above us. Okay. <laughs> what? The stopping of those turns is weird. Like oh. Yo, let's go. Used to levitate objects for a short time. Once you've completed a few prerequisite tasks, do see me after class. Ooh, okay. So we do have another quest to do. Let me see. Acquire and use a venomous tentacula. Acquire and use a mandrake on multiple enemies simultaneously. Okay, I think we do that first. Oh, we have the venomous... We have Venom Boy. If I remember correctly. Yeah, we have a bunch of... Oh, no, that's... Yeah, we have one of these. Unlocked by acquiring mandrake seeds at Dogweed and Deathcap. Okay. 
Where is, is Dogweed? Is that what that place is called? Am I losing my mind? The Magic Neep? Yeah. Dogweed and Death Cap. Is that another place? No. What? The broom racing secret rooms we don't need. Huh. It's gotta be out here somewhere. Right? Spider Lair, Small Bandit Camp. Dark Arts Battle Arena. What? Oh, interesting. Okay. Okay. That's weird. It does count Confringo as a dark art. Ooh. Hmm. Oh, God. That scared me for a second. A little paper mache dragon. Let's see. A bunch of those. We had that one, which we still didn't do. Yeah, because that's just Arn. I don't know where this shop is. Unless it is just this. Let's let's go see real quick. Because otherwise we don't have a Mandrake yet, so... I don't know. <laughs> we'll, we'll figure it out. All roads lead to Hogsmeade. Uh... E... Okay, yeah, so we're supposed to go this way. Okay. Go this way. Hmm. I'm debating maybe not using Confringo. What up, dog? Yeah, so you have seed packets. But none of them being... The ones we want. Titney. Yeah, it doesn't have Mandrake. Although, who wasn't there somebody? Oh, that girl. Hold on. I know where we can get these. The lady that's rude as hell. Yeah, and Keenbridge over here. Yeah, let's go over here. We can buy a Mandrake from that lady. And then use that on some enemies. And then we just gotta use the plant on some enemies. It's like a place right out of a storybook. Is it though? Is it though? Oh, and I guess we forgot to grab a thing. Oh, there's the ball. I Let's see it. See <laughs> Likewise, what can I help you with today? Uh, let me see. What do you your have wares? To Give me that mandrake. What are we looking for today? What? I thought I could have swore you had a Mandrake. Oh, unless it was Arn that had the Mandrake? Thank you for stopping All right. in. Well, at least we know where the ball is. Oh, come on, dude. There we go. Oops. Shoot it through. There we go. All right, now we gotta get it across the bridge. I am. Keep going. Okay, and it's to the left right there, yeah. There we go, there we go, look at us. Look at us. Would be proud. Genius. <laughs> I am recording this episode right after the last one. So uh, for everyone who is like, you were literally staring at it the entire cutscene. I apologize. <laughs> I have not had time to see those responses yet. So, uh, yeah. Oh, my bad. But now we're going to, we got to go to Arn. Who is right here. All right. We go to him. We zoomin. We zoomin. 
And then we'll just have to fly around and find enemies we could use these on. So that we can get this Wingardium Leviosa. Because I feel like it'll be convenient to have. Oi, Arn. My dog. Heard you got them yelling baby plants. Yep. Perfect. Give me that. Painting. Okay. Incredible how such darkness yep. Totally. Such Crazy. Beauty. Wow. So you have to use it on multiple enemies. So let's jump on the broom and just kind of fly around till we find some wolves. Because one enemy is not enough. Oh, we got a den over here. Oh, and it's wolves. Okay, hold up. There we go, baby. Oh my god, that's... Oh, I thought I cut his head off. I was like, Jesus Christ, that's dark. <laughs> All right. Oops. There you go, burns all the... Yeah, see, I'm still a little bit worried about using... Oh, shit. Oh, you know what? Hold on, I gotta use advanced plant anyway. Oh, God. Oh, that one feels pretty good. Oh. <laughs> God, they just burst into pelts, which feels messed up. Bad. <laughs> oh, God. Hey, come on over. There we go. Jesus. All right. So the venom plant, very good. That was pretty wild. Bunny. Come on back, bunny. What? Incendio. <laughs> that gave us XP. Oh, that's funny. Revenge. All right. Uh, oh, there's a bag up there. Accio. No, can I? There we go. Give me that. And then there's oh, moonstone. Wow. Alrighty. Bunch of deer. Accio. What? Deer. Do they give us loot? Like, is there a reason to do this? No. Okay. Get out of here. Hush. <laughs> All right. <laughs> terrible. Terrible, terrible. All right. Let's go to, uh, let's go to herbology class. And we'll get, we'll unlock. Oh, it's weird that our herbology teachers are teaching us Wingardium Leviosa, but whatever. I'm not going to complain. Um... But we'll go get this, then we'll go talk to Fig. And then, I do... Th ah. Whoops, I did not mean to do that. That was the wrong button. Um, I do kind of think I'm going to switch out this one. If it's considered dark arts. But then, like, this one literally cuts people. <laughs> So, like, how good are we? Same with this one. Hmm. Oh, we'll keep it. Why not? All right. Sorry, plant. Oh, I got to... I got to... Pass the time. Yes. Okay. Chill now. What up, ma'am? I don't like that. <laughs> oh, the chomping cabbages. They're so cute. <laughs> oh, Natty, um, Josh Gad, and somebody else from Hufflepuff who I'll never meet. <laughs> All right. How wonderful to oh, we, ha we do have Dittany leaves. It's funny. All right. Hey, I completed your task, ma'am. I've completed my assignments, Professor. Pleased to hear it. Professor Weasley will be too. I'll be sure to let her know how well you're coming along. Hell yeah. 
Professor Hecate tells me she taught you Levioso, so you should be ready for a more advanced levitation charm. Wingardium Leviosa requires a bit of concentration and a nice graceful wand movement. Let's see you try your hand at it. Okay, let's do it. When executed correctly, you should be able to pick up boulders as though they were sprigs of sneezewort. Ma'am, what? <laughs> Did it was any of that real words? <laughs> Alrighty, we got it. Let's see, can levitate and move objects. Control the position with your movement and use F, V, Q, and E to fine-tune its distance and rotation. Okay. So basically we're gonna we're gonna encounter more annoying. Okay. Wow, thank you. Oh yeah. Alright, so Wingardium Leviosa. Put it right there. I kinda like that being where it is. Okay. So let's go. Let's try this out. Okay. So we can rotate it like that. Oh, forward and back like that. Okay. So you could stack them, I'm assuming. Nope. We can get this. Sir. It doesn't like to be stacked, but you can. What is this? The random Edru's potion underneath that barrel? Okay. Or that box. Alright, cool. So we got our spell. We can go uh, hang out with Figgy McFiggerton. And uh, see what he wants. Yeah. Okay. We go here. And then he's going to be in here. I always forget he's the charms guy. <laughs> I just keep forgetting that completely. But whatever. Whatever. It's fine. Alright. Go. He's below. Okay. God damn it, Arthur. Alright. Go the long way. Did not go to the closest flu flame, but that's fine. Oh no, maybe we did. I think the other one's up. What up, dog? I was hoping to see you. Mm, don't like that. You're Too back. sexual. <laughs> Minister Spavin talks more than he listens. Ranted on and on about rogue dragons. Wouldn't listen to a word about goblins. Speaking of which... Listen, Professor. So much happened while you were away. Nick <laughs> Arthur's Nick asked me to get some rotten roast beef from the kitchens. Rotten roast beef? Yes, I thought it was odd too. But then... We took the roast beef to Sir Podmore of the Headless Hunt, and- You met the Headless Hunt? <laughs> that must have been interesting. Stop cutting me off, Grandpa. And then I had to find Richard Jackdaw's head in the pumpkins so that he'd tell me about how he died. Who on earth is Richard <laughs> Jackdaw? He was a student here long ago. Anyway, he told me about a secret cavern. I went there, and right next to Jackdaw's skeleton, I found the missing pages. You found the pages? Hell yeah. And because Jackdaw had followed the map they contained, when I found the pages, I found the location on the map. Believe it or not, it's a room below Hogwarts. Why am I not surprised? <laughs> Shall we? I was hoping you'd say that. Oh, and we'll need to bring the book. <laughs> Very casual. I love that. It had that the big, like... Uh, energy of that meme that's like the guy talking into the girl at the club's ear and she's like not interested but he's just going on and on it's called the map chamber by the way it's good and the portrait of Percival Rackham awaits us there Professor Rackham. hell yeah I look forward to meeting him how did this Jackdaw get the pages from the book Evidently, I don't know Peeves stole them, <laughs> and Jackdaw stole them from him oh I forgot we knew oh, that <laughs> Like, what the hell? It was beneath us all this time. There's so many horrible things below Hogwarts. <laughs> the Basilisk Chamber. This. Like, <laughs> people who made the school were horrible. <laughs> oh. You gotta, you gotta put that book down. 
Maybe, perhaps. Hell yeah, dog. Enter the book. Enter the book. <laughs> oh. And then we resurrect Rackham. Oh. Cool looking. <laughs> My guy's like, what the hell? <laughs> oh. Okay. A map. A map. There's Hogsmeade. And oh. over here, the Forbidden Forest. And of course. Oh. It's magnificent. <laughs> it's like, hey, that's what the map looks like to me when I opened the book I got. <laughs> Yo, Rackham? Rackham Sackham Robots? Where you at? If only you were here to see this. I'm standing right here, Professor. What the fuck? <laughs> Alrighty. Oh, what up, dog? Hello, Professor Rackham. We've placed the book on the pedestal as you asked. And this is my mentor, Professor Fig. This is my dad. I mean, Professor. <laughs> How you do, Professor Fig? And you, my young friend, see now why you needed to return with the book? I do. I also see why you refer to this room as the map chamber. Oh, oh but yeah, that makes sense now. <laughs> that makes a lot more sense. Magical ability, All right. The potential and power of which will unlock should you prove yourself worthy. Hell yeah, let's do the it. The location of each of four trials will, in time, appear on the map. Trials that will test you and give you access to invaluable knowledge. Okay. Trials that you must complete on your own. Do Hell yeah. You know all the pensive memory you viewed in my vaulting Gringotts. Uh, I'm I'm gonna be honest. <laughs> I don't recall fully. I do recall seeing the memory, but I don't remember all of the details. My friend Charles and I spoke of the port key, and of trials we'd created for one who could see traces of ancient magic. Charles okay. is another of the keepers, a designation we gave ourselves centuries ago, in light of the <laughs> knowledge that we have been bound to keep hidden. Oh, that's Until, perhaps <laughs> not the most creative. So, <laughs> passage from your ruins to Gringotts, everything in the vault, the restricted section, finding this room, none of these was a trial. <laughs> they were an important part of the journey, but they were not trials themselves. The fact that you have come this far, however, bodes well. The trials were designed to ensure that the power and knowledge we have kept secret for so long does not fall into the wrong hands. They will okay. test your abilities, both innate and learned. Hell yeah. But of equal importance, everything you witness as you complete the trials will inform what you choose to do with all that we share. You will need patience. The trials have much to teach you. It will take time. I'm afraid we don't have the luxury of time. Mm, that's not how that we works. We have waited this long, Professor Fig. Surely a few more. Respectfully, sir, while I do not know the secret you keep, I do know that our young friend here has seen traces. Traces of a powerful dark magic being wielded by goblin kind. And we encountered an uncommonly powerful goblin wielding such magic as we prepared to leave your vault at Gringotts. We may already be too late. This is grave news indeed. Young friend, do you trust Professor Fig? I do. Then, in the light of your <laughs> I was wondering if it'd give me the option. And all you have already accomplished, we shall begin. You will find the location of the first trial marked on the map below you. Okay. Whilst Professor Fig may assist you in locating the trials, they may be completed only by one with our ability. Uh, okay. I and mean, that makes sense. Shall we have a look? Oh. Is that? I know that tower. It's not far. <laughs> is that the tower I was just you at? <laughs> uh, I believe I have because I think I, it is the one that I was at. Perhaps your young friend is more well traveled than you might think. <laughs> As your mentor, the least I can do is go ahead to make sure it is safe. Join me as soon as you can. 
Okay. Uh, yeah, I'll see you there. I'll find you at the tower as soon as I can. Until then, be careful. And do not tell anyone where you're going. <laughs> we have so many secrets now. <laughs> Just the eventual uh, autobiography of my character is going to be good. Oh, we're learning Flipendo? Hell yeah. Okay. So yeah, now we're going to start getting a bunch of side quests. Okay. Let me... I want to learn Flipendo because that seems like it's good. Grow and harvest flux weed. Okay, acquire all three combat plants and use them simultaneously. Ugh. All right. That's going to be annoying because that means we got to get more. Um, we got to get more mandrake root. But let me see. Let me let me go. We need to go. We need to go to Hogsmeade to get the seeds of flux weed and then we need to go and then while those grow we can go run around and, and use the uh things because i want flipendo because that's it's it's the juggle spell it's perfect for me <laughs> oh it is an efficient way oh. to cool down a heated situation but first i will need you to complete a few tasks Once okay done that, come and see me. why is our why is the flying teacher teaching us a freezing spell this girl been cheating in her quidditch matches all right, let's go find give me some seeds. I think Flux, I'm pretty sure Fluxweed was one of the ones listed on here. Let's go over here. And uh, and see if we can buy it. Welcome. Come on in. Welcome. Yeah, Fluxweed, really, literally the first one. Cool. Now, the problem is we don't have a lot of money. Although we do have enough money for a Mandrake. No one can say I don't That's fine. That shelf. And then let's see. So this one is pop balloons over hogs me. Oh, that's what the slashing one's for. Okay, so we got to pop ones over Hogsmeade. And then pop ones over the Quidditch grounds. Um. Oh, you have to use the broom to pop them. Oh, interesting. So you have to fly through them. Okay. Okay, that's easy. And I mean, we are at Hogsmeade. So let's... What is this up here? Oh, there's freaking... I did not realize it was up there. I am dumb. I am very dumb. All right. <laughs> All right, let's go up there, see how much Mandrake root seeds cost. Or if we could just flat out buy a Mandrake from this person. I was going to say, I figured we'd had to have been there at least once. But, uh, oh, and then the balloons are right behind that. Nice. All right. So we can, we can knock out, we can kill a bunch of birds with a stone. Or I guess a broomstick in this case. But, uh, but let's see. I don't know if I've been here now. I'm <laughs> looking at the outside. Greetings. Come on inside. What up, dog? Watch yourself, though. Let's have you leave here alive. This man is just like... Surrounded oh, by man-eating oh, plants. Sorry, I'm in a bit of a tizzy. I was just scolding some of the plants for spitting and nipping. <laughs> I suppose it's my own fault. Okay. For more than four to a tray. By the way, Beatrice Green is the name, but you may address me as Madam Green. Madam Welcome Green. To okay. Welcome to and Death Cap. Oh, uh, mind you, don't knock the mandrakes. Oh, if there wasn't the constant demand for antidotes, I wouldn't need to stock so many of the little deers. <laughs> Except Jesus Christ. Horses. And well, if you've been petrified, then obviously you've come to the right place. <laughs> Mind you don't knock the mandrakes. Okay, oh, you just up. said that, ma'am. One to drop dead and I'm in no mood for a clear up. Okay. Let me let me let me see your but damn wares. So I'm going to assume oh, mandrake oh, seeds are going to be expensive. 800. Ugh. Okay. I mean, we we buy a Mandrake in order to complete the quest, but we yeah, eventually want seeds for all these. Scaring all the go oh, I'm always thrilled when a young okay. one makes a wise purchase. So we grab that. We can leave now. Hogsmeade, here I come. And then since I am here, 
Let's go... Do I have to leave Hogsmeade a very specific route? Yeah, I do. <laughs> I thought there was a chance. Take all those. Is this considered Hogsmeade Station? I don't actually know. No, I tossed out a bunch of cabbages. I wish that wasn't the same button. <laughs> see, is there other balloons? Not that I can see. So I'm going to pop these ones and see what happens. A blow. Does that count, though? I get the feeling that they don't. But we'll see. Bam. Chat we unlocked a challenge, but that wasn't the one she wanted. Hold on. Right? Let me take a look. Yeah, no, so it's over Hogsmeade Station. Where the hell is that? Alright, let's go back to Hogsmeade. I don't know what that area is. I mean, we'll go there eventually, but... Oh, we have the... There's some enemies over here. What kind of enemies? Oh, just ba like bad dudes. Okay. Let's, uh... You like what my mother used to make? Like heads of lettuce, those mushrooms were. Oh, they see me. Oh. Who's there? Yep. Okay, there we go. Loyalist warrior? All right. So we got to use all three plants simultaneously in combat. So let's just get behind them. We rock that. Oh, Jesus. All right. Whoops. Yeah, totally. Look how ridiculous. Oh. Oh. You just got murdered by cabbages and lightning. Let's go. <laughs> it's one hell of a way to die. All right. So we've done that now. <laughs> that quest has been completed. We can go up here, grab this. We can loot whatever this is. Oh, some, some bugs. Okay. Give me those. I mean, we're here, so we might as well do the Merlin thing if we can. We'll run up here and grab this. Although, I'm lazy. <laughs> we do this. Ooh, some Ashwinder eggs. Nice. Could it be a Merlin trial? Do it. Now, what do we got to do for this Rebellion. one? Oh. There's one there. There's one up there. There's one up there. Okay. And they all have to be lit at the same time, roughly. Let me go here, because there's something over here. Oh, maybe not. Let's see. We have that one. I think from right here I could get all these. Let me, uh... Yeah, let me break these down. And then I think... Oh shit, fell. There we go. And then oh. There we go. These Merlin trials won't get the best. Hey. Hey. Okay, there we go. Easy money. We got that one. We'll take it. We'll take it. Grab that. Definitely should do this. Better grab everything in the area. Okay. I don't see the enemy that's near us, but that's fine. What is... Oh, that... It's just... Okay. Oh, there's a flu flame right below us. Look. Hey, can I unlock this? Or is this something we're going to have to unlock later? Revelio. Mm, no. You can't oh god. Are you do you have a quest for me? What seems to be the problem? You may well ask. 
I'm convinced I saw a grim, an omen of death. <laughs> Not safe. Uh oh. But if it can't see me, I'll be all right, won't I? All I need sure. is an invisibility potion. Yes, that's what I need. Okay. Uh, I'm all out currently. I'm afraid I'm all out of invisibility potion. I suggest finding somewhere safe and being especially careful. Safe? Careful? Uh, yes, that makes sense. And you're sure you don't... No. Uh. Very well. Interesting. I wonder if we the grim or whatever it has foretold hmm. doesn't get me first. I wonder if we would have had a thing we would have gotten like something for that. Interesting. Okay. All right. Let us. Where where is Hogmead? <laughs> where where's Hogsmeade from where we are standing right now? Okay, so it's over there. So the station. That's not the station. Upper Hogsfield. Hmm. Field page guides over here. Is th this must be the station over here then? This little area. So we'll set, we'll set one for there. We'll fly over there. Yeah. I think that's where we're going. That feels somewhat correct. Oh, there's a salesperson down there, but whatever. This Don't place has seen super days. care. Alright, we'll make our way over. Cause we're just looking for the balloons. And yeah, Hogsmeade's right there. Oh yeah, okay, it makes sense. So we're, we got the we got the train tracks below us. So actually oh yep, there's the balloons right there. Okay, cool. We'll go ahead, come on over Sometimes here. Sometimes it seems all roads lead to oh, Hogsmeade. Wait, what? Okay, we can fly out from right here. Rebellion. Oh, we got the chocolate frogs. Yeah, nice. Okay. Oh, they're not gonna let. Me oh my god, how annoying! Am I technically in Hogsmeade right now? Is that why? Just jump down. <laughs> You'll be fine. <laughs> You'll live, kid. What? Ooh. Okay, there we go. Now there is... Incendio. What? Alright, there we go. <laughs> Let's fly through these damn balloons. Bam. 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 Grab that one. And then one more. Should be one more somewhere. Because that wasn't five, was it? No, no balloon in the train track. What? What? Hold on. Did we... Yeah, four or five. Am I losing my mind? Let me see. Fly down slightly. Is there one like... Yeah, I was thinking it could be down below, but it doesn't look like it. Let me see. Because they've all been bunched up so far. What the hell? Where's the other balloon? Oh, there it is. There it is. Come here. Come here, balloon. Ah. All right. There we go. And now we do have... There's just stuff in this area, so let's check it out. Oh. What do you mean landing not available? Is it going too fast? Let's see, it's right Rebellion. here. Yeah. We got Hogsmeade Station. Okay. There's a cell thing on the other side of this wall. I 
can't hop the wall. Alright. And there's a couple Merlin things over here. We'll take a look. See if we have what it is necessary to, uh, to do those. What up, Leopold? Hello. Do you have anything for sale? That I do. But, uh, what's a student like yourself doing out here? Got yourself lost, did you? Nope. I like to explore. <laughs> Just exploring the countryside a bit. Hi. <laughs> nice to break the routine now and then. Oh, this dude has a bunch of potion bit stuff. I'm a wanderer myself, in fact. The name's Leopold Babcock, and I am indeed here to sell. Okay. Now, a show. For someone like yourself who is also prone to wander, I cannot understate the importance of keeping some Wigan World potion on. Uh, all right, Grandpa. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> a place like the Forbidden Forest without a steady supply. What do you say, my young friend? A measure of safety for the path ahead? Something to consider. Thank you for your help, Mr. Babcock. Okay. Uh, let me know if you see something you like. All right. Yeah, let me see your wares. What do you have for sale? It's kind of cute. Something you need. Oh. oh, he has a fancy broom. A sky scythe? That's pretty sick. Okay, so he just has... Kind of the same stuff all these, like, random merchants have. They have a special broom plus combat That's tools. Okay. Let's go over here, see what this one is. Which... Let me really quickly see... Huh. So we rock that. Oh, okay, so it's a, um... It's a light all the things on fire one. So we got the one here. Okay, there's one there, one there. And then one there. Okay. Run. Run. Hey, let's go. All right. So that's another, that's another four slots for inventory. Very nice. Very, very nice. Alrighty. So we got that. Um, was there another one? I mean, there's a lot in this area as a whole. But I think we're just, I'm just going to work on the quest. I want to try to get these two done. And turn them in, and that will be this episode, essentially. But let me do this one. We gotta go to the Quidditch pitch. So let's go... Oh, can I not... I can't go to those? There's no fast travel over there, really. Yeah, I guess none of these count. Interesting, okay. I mean, oh, okay, there we go. Hogwarts North exit, all right. We'll go over here, pop the balloons, and then go plant a bunch of stuff, and then we should have Flipendo and Glacio. Which, I'll take that. Okay, we can fly here. Damn. And I see the balloons. <laughs> so we pop. We get this one. So that means probably another spell will require us to pop balloons. If there's multiples in the area. Not that one. There's this one. There's one more somewhere. Right there. I see ya. Oops. Bam! Alright. Easy money. Now we can land. And teleport to our room of requirements. And just start planting. <laughs> yeah, let me go here. Room of requirements. That's cool that the map chamber is also on there. I like that all those things that aren't necessarily near each other are under the same tab so it's easy to manage. All right, give me that. Ooh, I just realized, yeah, this is probably going to take a decent amount of time. 
Wait, where's our... No! Okay, that's pretty annoying. So we need a bigger pot size, but I think that's like 1,500 gold. Oh, okay. We do got fertilizer. <laughs> so that's nice, I guess. Um, okay, so we need a medium pot. All right, well, let's just go. Let's go get... Let me go get this... Let me go talk to Madam Kagawa. We'll get her stuff. Yeah, there we go. And we'll get her stuff, and then... Um, we'll probably cut this episode short, just by a little bit. And then we will... Uh, next episode, we'll do... Not the main quest, but we'll go explore that whole area we were just at. So that um, we can get those side quests done and potentially get a bunch of money. How did you get Rebellion's tasks? Well, I'm broke, Miss Kagawa, so I'd like some money for this. Uh, Dear Madam Kagawa, I'm writing to do with Professor Black's decision to cancel Quidditch. As you know, joining a professional Quidditch team is my utmost dream, and I believe my chances will now be ruined or at least significantly thwarted. Professor Weasley insists that we must defer to the headmaster, and she encouraged me to practice on my own. I have devised some challenging trials for myself, but it is not at the, all the same as practicing on the pitch. Nothing is. Please, could I ask that you speak to the headmaster or to Professor Weasley? I shall be miserable my whole life if I can't play Quidditch properly for this entire year. Thank you, Professor Imelda Reyes. Okay, that's the girl we bodied in her time trial, so obviously she's not going to go pro, but, you know, she can dream. Uh, <laughs> dear Madam Kagawa, marvelous news that you'll be joining the faculty at Hogwarts as our new flying instructor. I dare say our work together at Hogwarts will be less eventful than our than our time near Yokohama Harbor, though one never knows. I shall look forward to seeing you soon. If you have any questions in the meantime, please do not hesitate to send me an owl. Warm regards, Matilda Weasley. All right. So she's the new teacher in the lawn. Oh, she has a chest we can loot. Give me that money. All right. Oh, we got the gray adventure. Is that her? Oh, no, no, no. She's something else. She has her Madam Quidditch Gower, team name. I completed the list of tasks you assigned. Wonderful. I Hell yeah. trust you became more familiar with your broom through the process? Yes. Sure. <laughs> uh, you could be like, nah, really. I just popped some balloons. Not really uh, the most challenging thing yes, in the world. Professor. That's good to hear. Keep it up, and perhaps one day you'll have a spot on the Quidditch team. If Black ever permits Quidditch again. Well, <laughs> there better be Quidditch at some point. Way. Let us get started. Glacius. Okay. Pay attention to your wand work. Oh, oh, that's cute. It's a little mountain because it's an ice spell. Clever. Go. 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 All right, we've learned Glacius. New spell unlocked. I'd recommend that you practice your new spell here. Oh. Okay. You trust me a lot to be using this spell in your office, man. That's all I'm gonna say. To the world. Let's see. There you go. Okay, so it just it freezes the target. Oh, does it have a shatter like type thing? Cause that's an interesting combo if it is. Like if we do that. Okay. Let me see. We hover over it. Okay, so yeah, so it does kind of have a shatter-esque effect. That's interesting. So you could do that, then do any other AoE spell. Or I guess if you upgraded this, you could then do an AoE spell that has a similar effect to it. That's pretty cool. I still think I like Levioso more. But that's that's actually not bad. I can get down with that. Okay. Okay, that's cool. I, it's not as juggly, but I guess it's more like, oh, you're trying to hit really hard with one attack. Like maybe that one plus Confrigo is a good combo. Or I guess that would be like the way I just used it. That one with, um, what was that spell called? 
Defendo? Yeah. That could be a decent combo. Freeze some people in the area, then chain a saw blade towards them. I could, I could get behind it. Um, but yeah, I'm a, yeah, we're at a point where we need to go do all of these, not Hogsmeade, go do, oh my god, world's map, it kept changing positions. So we got this area up here, uh, upper Hogsfield that we got a couple side quests at, and then we also have Pit, what is that? Pit upon Ford that might have some stuff. So we'll go check around, do some, uh, Side quest next episode, hopefully get enough money to upgrade our pot so that we can actually plant the the fizzweed. And uh and yeah, because we haven't been getting much loot either. We have a couple of things. Like the Grey Adventure one, but that's only 90. Like we're not not rolling in dough. What is this? That's hideous. <laughs> I hate that. Uh, let's go back to to this one. Yeah, that one. That yeah, that one's gross. All right, <laughs> I'm gonna get out of here. Thank you guys so much for watching, and hopefully, I see you next time. See ya.